This is Snapchat. Without switching to a custom app, just place your phone on top and press print. A few seconds later, you'll have a beautiful Polaroid photo of your phone screen. Snapchat is a slim, portable instant film printer for your smartphone. It's like a tiny photocopy machine you can bring anywhere. The best thing about Snapchat is its simplicity. All you need to do is put your phone on top, press one button, and you get a flawless photo. It doesn't need any apps, wires, or Bluetooth to function. With Snapchat, the possibilities are endless. If you can see it, you can print it. Imagine a birthday card with a selfie that was taken 30 seconds ago. Or what about printing a custom business card at your next meeting? Snapchat's text is sharp and clear. Never be caught with an outdated business card again. And next time, instead of running a giant expensive photo booth for your special occasion, why not use a Snapchat instead? Snapchat prints on Fuji, Instax, or Polaroid 300 film, and its innovative design can support any smartphone. Polaroid is near and dear to my heart. As a photographer, I was just really excited about working with instant film again. And I loved that Snapchat was incorporating the use of a smartphone because it's just so convenient to take photos. We wanted something that pushed the limits of what's possible with instant film. Like digital effects, fluorescent ink, a pocket video that doesn't require a single battery, lenticular film, and transparencies that come to life with an Arduino and some simple LEDs. We're actually really excited to see what people make with Snapchat and where it's used. So the biggest challenge with Snapchat was creating a really slim device. We designed something that takes what would normally be a lens space of about 150 millimeters and squash it down into just one millimeter. We reached out to David Welker and Paradigm Optics. We specialize in all polymer optical devices. The fiber optic array is the main component of the Snapjet scanning mechanism. Making the custom order for Snapchat was challenging because there were material combinations that we had never done before. It basically required a reconfiguration of the entire oven to make it work. <laughs> we did all of our prototyping in-house. We used laser cutting, machining, and even a kickstarted 3D printer to produce our first prototypes. Once we get funding, we'll have the resources to create our injection mold tooling, we'll be able to produce our printed circuit boards in large quantities, and we'll be able to assemble our devices. Snapchat's hardware and software will all be open sourced. We're going to release our PCB schematics, our CAD designs, and anything else that a maker would need to hack, reprogram, and make it better. One day, we envisioned Snapchat's optical technology in a printer so slim that it could be part of a smartphone case. Snapchat is an amazing creative tool. It's a great way to connect, to preserve memories, and it's really fun. By backing Snapchat, you're backing the idea that innovation should be open to everyone. And instant film technology, pioneered by the iconic Polaroid company in 1948, still has a few surprises in store for us. Now, we really need your help on Kickstarter to back our project and make Snapchat a reality. And we won't stop until it's in your hands. Join us in revolutionizing instant film. Did you know that a significant number of dead batteries you throw away had only used roughly 20% of their battery life? What if you could instantly tap into the other 80% that is still trapped inside? Now you can with Batterizer. Batterizer is a reusable stainless steel sleeve that slips over your new or used batteries and taps into the 80% that is usually thrown away. When your batteries are running out of juice, just slip the Batterizer micro-thin sleeve over your low or dead battery. Insert it back into your device and see your power level jump from low to 100% instantly. The idea of Batterizer was to come up with a way of squeezing all the juice out of the battery before you throw it away. We tested the Batterizer in our lab and we confirmed that the Batterizer taps into that 80% energy that is usually thrown away. What is most impressive about Batterizer, aside from its performance, is the fact that this technology would have not been available a few years ago. It is now only by pushing the edge of technology in industrial design, mechanical design, and electrical design that we've been able to achieve such miniaturization. For too long, alkaline batteries have largely been unchanged in either their construction or their delivery of satisfaction. Batterizer changes all that. The average household has over 25 different battery-powered devices. 
and Batterizer is designed to instantly extend their battery life. Batterizers can pay for themselves and it's reusable time and time again. Every year over 15 billion batteries end up in a landfill. If you stack them on top of one another, you reach to the moon, you wrap around the moon two times, you come back to Earth. I have not seen anything that I'm as excited about as this product. I really need your help in order to get this thing to mass production and get this innovative breakthrough technology in everybody's hands. Hi, I'm Ken, and I'm the creator of the Tempiscope. I released the first Tempiscope three years ago as an open source project uh, when I was looking for ways to feel the tropical skies in my daily life. And ever since, I've received overwhelming interest from people all over the world, uh, which is why we're excited to announce our first campaign to actually get the Tempiscope into your hands. Our team consists of engineers and designers based in Tokyo, and we now have everything we need other than the actual funds to get, um, get into mass production. I really need your help to get this exciting new product into reality. So thank you very much for your support. Mein Name ist Thomas Panek und ich bin einer der Gründer von Storyhome. Bei Storyhome war meine Rolle, dass ich für den Produktentwicklungsprozess zuständig war und für, die für das Bauen der entsprechenden Prototypen in dem Projekt. Wir glauben daran, dass jeder eine Geschichte zu erzählen hat. Storyhome ist ein Device, das es hilft, Großeltern und Enkelkindern zu verbinden und zwar über Geschichten. Die Großeltern können diese Geschichten in unser Device hineinsprechen und diese Geschichten werden an ein Cloud-System geschickt und landen dann auf dem zweiten Device, das im Schlafzimmer der Enkelkinder sitzt. Und die Enkelkinder können dann diese Geschichten ähm, auch mit, mit Hilfe des Devices anhören und zur Schlafenszeit einschlafen. Und am Anfang haben wir diese ganzen cloud critic systeme im Internet verwendet. Problem dabei war wirklich, dass äh, die Iterationszyklen viel zu lange gedauert haben. Wir haben zwei Wochen gebraucht, bis wir den neuen Prototypen wieder in der Hand halten konnten und Verbesserungen, die wir in der Zeit uns ausgedacht haben, waren einfach ein großes Problem. Und äh, der Form One Plus hat uns wirklich geholfen, diesen Prozess um einiges zu beschleunigen. Und mit dem Form One Plus konnten wir diese Kosten äh, um das Hundertfache reduzieren. Die Qualität ähm, am Schluss von dem Ausdruck war wirklich perfekt. Die Nachbearbeitung war nicht zu groß und ähm, ja, das Ergebnis spricht dann wirklich für sich.